So where was I? Where I am right now? I'm just here in the shop back again where we're going to be removing that starter right there. And um, once again, uh, being pretty precautious and understanding the uh, uh, major mechanical concept on this engine. So if you actually drive a truck, I would say several years, you should understand all the components on these uh, particular uh, engines. Now, this is a Detroit, so I know so much, yet not much on a Detroit engine. But understanding the concept and the signals and sounds and uh, defects can identify the wearing, wearing parts of the uh, starter. So in this particular case, there's a plastic cover back where it holds the starter that's broken off already after five years later we understand that we are lucky to be here to fix this before we have a breakdown over the road now once this is out i'm going to show you what's really broken actually let me zoom in a little bit close up so you can see what's going on here now all the terminals are going to be cleaned out and uh, all the other parts are going to be removed. Now there's the area where it's cracked and broken. I don't know if you can see it, but once I get this out, we're going to take a look at it. Right over here, what we're going to get to do is um, we're going to remove the U-bolt here. And we're going to get all this done today. And um, the airbag is crooked, so the center point and this under the airbag, the, the plate or the center point is broken, it's tilted, so we're gonna have to replace that. Also, we believe that we're gonna be also changing a slack adjuster, and that's what we're gonna get done. So before we hit the, hit the road. Right over here, I found a, a reputable guy that who is going to do the repair on that hood that was damaged about a month ago. He told me that he can go ahead and Sorry about that. Whew. Anyway, got all the dust on my nose. <laughs> the guy's laughing. Anyway, so we're gonna get this all polished, but we're gonna do it next time before uh, real gets hot in summary. So he's a very professional polisher, so he's gonna polish this whole thing. It's gonna look nice. Well, right over here, uh, we changed the batteries, and we got about 1,000 CCA, uh, 12 volt, uh, heavy duty batteries. Um, so we, we go ahead and uh, did this too, about last month, in the same time where the truck got hit. So, this is a unexpectable uh, expense, just uh, hit us hard on this. But I think I remembered we changed it about a year or two ago, but I don't know why the batteries uh, had no power at all. So, yep, we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be good, I think, this year. Aha, uh -huh, we got this old alternator. <laughs> Uh -huh. Well, guys, this is uh, out, and this is what's broken actually, and this was causing problem. This uh, starter has been on the truck for about five years. Everything else looks, everything else looks good, but except this is broken. So I'm glad that we changed this. We fixed the. Pr like adjuster but definitely this thing right there it's all done I'm pretty happy you, you, you've seen that old picture there broken piece